Hey everybody, this is not a spring chicken. Yesterday, of course, the U.S. Open of Surfing was this past weekend, and to celebrate the 21st, 25th anniversary of riots at the U.S. Open of Surfing, of course, we're riots. And now we're going to bring old Cam Allen comments on the headlines of today. Hey, <laughs> I dropped it again. Oh. Well, problem is, I don't generally do this with glasses on, folks. Oh, that throws everything off. Yeah, I don't wear glasses when I do anything like this. I can juggle, I just can't juggle with glasses on. And it's all over for the Republicans. Well, they said that the uh, Republicans and their continuing attacks on the President of the United States on his so-called phony scandals, and the Republicans, Rush Limbaugh is finished, John Hannity is finished, the uh, uh, Bill O'Reilly is barely hanging on, Laura Ingram, all of them are gone now because the sponsors are demanding they stop it. I uh, stopped these vicious attacks on these phony scandals. Well, like Rush Limbaugh said this morning, oh, this one company is getting rid of me off of their 40 stations, and Clear Channel is adding me on the 100 stations, so 140, 100. What well, said, remember, I'm not the President of the United States. I actually can add, and 100 is greater than 40. Mm -hmm. And Amazon announced a new hiring spree ahead of the Obama visit. Well, it started out this morning before they knew he was coming. It's 1,300 part-time hires at fulfillment centers across the United States. That after they knew he was coming, it ended up 5,000 full-time uh, hires across fulfillment centers in this country. And then when they found out that he was available to tell everybody about how good things were working, it is 7,000 full-time workers all of them immediately signing up for the Affordable Care Act. Anybody? Okay, a a every time they made a new announcement that they Amazon stock died. Oh, one other thing. Uh, uh, they were heavy supporters of the Obama presidential campaign. And anybody remember all those people that Best Buy hired? And all those people that were hired by Caterpillar? And all those other? They don't ever get hired. Mm -hmm. It's just all for publicity. And they, um, I, I did hear one of the, de one of the people on... Uh, one of the, the financial channels that basically gave worse the ground the president walks on, he said, haven't we heard this crap before? Mm -hmm. He said, I'm waiting to see how many people actually do get hired. And another guy said, the 1,300 part-time workers they were originally going to hire will be the only ones that are hired. Mm -hmm. And the scandals are a dead news item, according to the Democrats. Oh, yeah. Well, nobody wants to know about the scandals. Uh, no one wants to know, no one wants answers of why the military, which was a hundred and some miles away, Okay, we're going to put it this way. I used to make westerns. My father made westerns. Even though I played Indians, my father played cowboys. You know why they put the forts in the west the way they were? So that you could get to the next fort in time to save the fort if it was under Indian attacks. They were basically strategic put. Anybody know what a mic, what a mic outfit is in the military? It's an, it's an organization that's basically flown in by helicopters to handle the situation. And so basically, the cavalry comes to the rescue. The cavalry, well, we couldn't send them this time because we weren't aware of how bad the situation is or how long it would last. They're watching it by satellite in real time. There, there is no, I mean, the only people that don't realize there is a problem is the Democrats. I mean, I, and last night I saw one of, the, one of the family members basically offering to take the smug-ass look off of one of the Democrats. Well, this is just a phony problem. No one cares. Of course, she cared. Mm -hmm. She don't care that her kid was killed. And China orders audit of local government debts. Yeah, they're trying. How in the world could we be in such financial problems? Because they're spending. Okay, they are. Okay, you know what? The one thing that we are sending to China. What? We're the only people in the world that build printing presses. Mm. We're sending them. We're selling them printing presses so they can print their money, which is becoming more and more worthless because. They're, they're using their gold reserves to buy our stuff because we won't take their money because it's not worth anything. And North Korean ship carrying Cuban weapons smells of scandal. Yeah, because they're going to want, they're wanting to know how the Obama administration let them get those weapons. They should never have got to Panama. It's really, it's embarrassing for the Panamanian governments to discover they have to go through our waters to get to Panama and nobody on the Obama side basically discovered they were smuggling stuff. You know, it, it really was difficult to find it too. They could smell aviation fluid everywhere. You could smell uh, fluid for the rockets everywhere. And you could smell explosive everywhere. But Obama people couldn't find that. And a single dog in Panama discovered everything. And cans $53 million in jewels stolen in massive heist in France. Yeah, from the same place that the jewels were stolen from during the uh, Cannes Film Festival. Isn't that amazing? Oh, it is. Yeah, I thought it was Interesting. Great.
I know, the one they said wasn't, di was just a minor thing. Well, that minor thing is now, it was a snatch and grab of $53 million worth. They go snatch and grab that. That's period. a planned. Yeah. That's a planned heist. $53 million is a lot. Yeah. yeah. Um, the scandals are a dead news item according to the de Democrats. I know she likes that one. Oh, done well. it three times now, so. State-funded colleges now pretty much offer an Occupy Studies program. Do you believe that the what? Democrats are now giving courses on how to shut down businesses in this nation? They, okay, the, here's the one that Democrats have never fully understood it. When you shut the business down, you can't get taxes from them, and people don't get hired. And when no one is paying taxes because they're not getting hired, you can't keep the people in the welfare system anymore. Boy, you know, that's just about as good as the college is, what, having courses on, what, how to do computer hacking. Oh, yeah, I love it. When I was in college, I'm going to tell you the great one. We had women's studies classes all being ran by men. Oh, they did. Because women didn't teach, women basically didn't give a rest ass in an educational site about women's studies. So a man would have to explain to you, you know, uh, we're listening to the thing about their, all, all the guys, uh, yeah, like we, we want to know, well, you have to have women's studies because it's a requirement in the state of California. Yeah, nobody, nobody. It was. That. So what happened was somebody take notes to everybody else to go do something else in the class. Oh, and voters shifting right force House of GOP to keep pace. Yeah, the problem is that the Republicans <coughs> cannot understand. Will the Democrats ever do anything to piss off their base? Never. But the Republic, well, we've got to move beyond our base. Uh, and basically, they said, uh, I heard this, Rand Paul said that, well, Chris Christie said, F you to the Republican base because we're going to get we're going to get the Democrats to like us and they will put us in office. Yeah, never a chance. Never and chance. Boeing requests worldwide checks of Honeywell begins. Seems like another battery problem, folks. Honeywell's battery. Okay, here's the problem is, is that the batteries they are building today were never designed to carry the load that they're now carrying on these things. I mean. Uh, I remember when I was flying jets, you could go, the pilot could go in the back of the plane and take a battery out of his pocket and put it in the system. That's how much battery power you needed for your instrumentation. Today, they have batteries the size of, a, of an ice chest because the, pow the planes are all ran by electronics, unlike wires like they used to be ran by. Family of ousted Egyptian President Morsi denounces the military and urges his release. Yeah, well, if, if she's not going to get released, he's likely to disappear. Uh, first of all, the military, I'm gonna, we're going to explain it a thousand times. I know the people at the Obama administration don't listen, and most of the repressed don't listen, but it is, un, it is unconstitutional for members of the Muslim Brotherhood to hold office in the Middle East. And so who did Obama support? People that were forbidden by law from running for office because these people are terrorists. They kill people. Like I saw this morning, I had, yeah, well, these people advocate killing kids in nursery schools, and that's the person you want to have running your government. Oh. And Trayvon Martin case polls reveal a depth of racial divide. There's no, okay, first of all, even the Democrats didn't bring up race in the, in the conviction. They didn't charge him with a race crime. They charged the guy with illegally shooting a person. Uh, and, and that's what, you know, so you can't bring up, there, it isn't about race. First of all, I'm going to try to explain it again. Anybody see my hair color, folks? I cannot walk through gated communities. I am white, and I tend to have blonde, whitish hair, and I'm old, and they will not let me cut through gated communities to cut off four or five blocks when I go walking. Mm -hmm. And so you think they're going to let somebody that doesn't, anybody that doesn't belong in that community come through? You have to go through a checkpoint. You just don't walk in. They got gates mm -hmm. to get on the property. You're there illegally, folks. And Wiener's new sex were too much for his campaign manager. Well, they expect Wiener to win. <laughs> they fully expect him to win because, as the Democrats are saying, well, just because he's got a, he's got a few problems with women, they're, they're the ones that basically Republicans are trying to destroy women, and but it's the Democrats that keep getting charged. We see no reason why this individual that's a sick puppy isn't going to do a good job as president. They're calling him a sick puppy now. They're calling him a sick puppy. Yeah. Well, his wife is being screwed now. Turns out, well, she was working for the United States government. She made $350,000 on the side. Ooh, doing what? Uh, doing, see, uh, they're, they're trying to figure out where she got the 350. But they do now. They did the checking. The other Democratic candidate did the checking, and it seems that Miss Uma picked up 350. 
doing other jobs because when they go deep into your income taxes, they find out how much money you made. Hmm, perhaps she was doing that while, oh wait, Lena was busy. Yeah. Yes. And a Monty Bubbles and some Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. <laughs> oh, uh, this one, this is a good one. That it seems to be the standard, uh, the norm today, that a lot of members of the press know about the criminal misconduct that's getting ready to happen before it actually happens. <laughs>